Hi guys, how are you doing? I hope you're doing fine. I hope you're taking care. So in case you're new here, my name is Domian and welcome to Cozy and Comfy. So today I'll show you what you can do with your old wine bottles or bottles at home. And I also received a package from Jumia and I'll unpackage it with you guys. So stay tuned and without further ado guys, let's get started. So these are the bottles that I'll be recreating just in a bit and the first thing I do I'll just wipe the bottles to get rid of excess dust or dust so that I can easily paint them through and I'll start with the green one and I'm planning to paint it white so stay tuned. I'll be using the white silk vinyl emulsion. I'll just have them painted in two coats and so I'm starting with the first coat then I'll leave it dry and then I'll continue with the other coat so stay tuned for you to see everything how it goes. I'm done with the first coat so I let it dry then do the second coat in the second coat what I do is just do the same thing and so I'll not just bore you guys with all that process I'll just come back to continue the remaining steps I'm already done with the second coat and so I'm here to continue the remaining steps and what I'm planning to do is basically draw someone on this bottle and so I did a sketch with a pencil you can just do it without doing the sketch if at all you're good in that without just you don't have to, to sketch it for you to do it but you can just sketch just to be sure the image that I'm drawing here is basically just an African woman yeah just that you can draw any image that you feel will look nice on the bottle any image just any image and i think that it will still look pretty so let's just continue So for dressing, I'll dress this woman in red and I'm using this kind of red color and I'll just use the brush number two. So that's what I'm doing. It's an easy to follow step. You can just follow through everything and yeah, it's just so simple. Anyone can do it. You can just have fun with your brushes and paints. You can just past time you can just do anything you can learn yeah, it's time to learn what you love doing you don't have even to like know how to do it like you know no it's, you can just have to like you know when you keep on trying trying you can by the end of the day you get that you are improving on your skills yeah on this woman's dressing you can have it dotted you can have it striped and you can just leave it like that so I'll just have it dotted so for the other bottle I had it painted in black and I just removed the label before painting it and the black paint that I'm using is still silk paint and I'll just paint it through in black just the way I did in the other one the only difference is that this is in black you can have it painted in any other color and that's what I'm just doing no no much difference so that's what I'm doing and then after that I'll leave it dry then go in with the second coat then leave it dry again and then I'll show you 
what I'm planning to do with this other bottle. I'm now done with the first coat, I let it dry then go in with the second coat and then I'll be back to show you how I'm planning to go around with this bottle. This is how the bottle looks after the second coat and for this bottle everything is just so simple. I'm planning to write on this bottle, I'm just planning to write Black Lives Matter, yeah you know Black Lives Matter. Reason as to why I planned to write this bottle Black Lives Matter is because you know yeah Black Lives Matter and this is because of late you know there have been so many killings of black people and this is a way for me to pass a message that you know black life is important there is no need for you to be a racist you know racism is not a nice thing even to talk about so that's why I just decided to write on this bottle that black lives matter I'll just write it black lives matter with white paint this is the same paint that I used before on the other bottle and I'm using brush number one so simple and you can just have it written in any font for me I didn't choose a specific font I just went in and wrote black lives matter just so simple simple and it's a way of passing a message I haven't forget that I told you I'll show you a package that I just received and I'll unpackage it with you guys and I'll just show you in a bit so stay tuned and keep watching keep enjoying and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so finally I'm done you can see how cute the bottle turned out so simple you can Recycle your bottles at home in many many different ways and so I'll just have them placed on these hanging shelves that I made on a previous video and I'll link it down below for you guys to go and watch in case you haven't watched and you can see how nice they look and they're just bottles you can just get creative with your bottles at home 
draw anything that you like and have them placed somewhere and they can act such as good deckers and you know it's still a way of passing a message if you, you wrote something on them just that so simple yeah the bottles can still act as vases for your flowers whether you are having natural flowers or artificial flowers they'll still act as vases and for the natural flowers you can just add water into the bottles and then place your flowers in there and you'll keep on maybe replacing the water and that's so simple and it will still serve as functional and in the same way they'll still act as decorative i remember guys i told you that i'll be unpackaging something with you and so here's the time to do so i had ordered a package from jumia and it was a mini tripod but it seems so small and i'm just so nervous i want to open and see what's in this package yeah but i'm going to do it with you guys for you to see what's in here Like it's so small. <laughs> Look at this tripod. But it's a mini tripod. Although it's so small. But it's okay. It's better than nothing. I'll buy a larger one in some days. So for now, this will do. It was an octopus tripod. Don't know if you guys have seen it. So here is the tripod. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so small. Oh, here is the baby tripod. So tiny, tiny, but I love it. Just looks so nice. It's better than nothing. Yeah, at least it will help me do what I have to do in filming. And in some days I'll get a larger tripod. But for now, let's work with this one. Here is the tripod with with the phone. I have already attached the phone, the holder, the phone holder, and it's it's so tiny, but not not bad. But I was hoping it for it to be at least long. But I don't know if there's other tripods. Maybe this is how this version of tripod looks like. But you can adjust these stands. You can adjust them the way you want. Yeah, I'll just learn on how i can maneuver with this tripod as time goes by but otherwise it's good it's nice i'm happy yeah even though i, I was expecting something large but i'm just happy it's okay it's working well it's doing well i'm happy about it and maybe in some days we'll get a larger one but for now this will do yeah in adjusting this is how you can adjust it you, you can see you can just play around with these stands and you can have them the way you want so otherwise the tripod is nice doing well i just love how jumia has delivered but it took a while i don't know if it's about the shipping or it took a while for this tripod to be here otherwise everything is okay I know even if I get the bigger one, I'll still be in need of this in one way or another and so it's still a good choice and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and hit the notification bell and in case you try doing something out of your bottles, let me know and always remember that in everything you do, do it passionately. Until next time, bye guys.